to another PRB Landed Home series. Today we are in District 28, Luxus Hills. Today we have a very beautifully renovated semi-detached to show you. 400k spent on renovations, which TOP in the end of 2020. So we are also within 1km to Rosai Primary School. A build up of about 4,500 square feet, five bedrooms, five bathrooms. Come, let's check out this home together. Before we kickstart this home tour, uh, I just want to share with you guys a bit more about the Luxus Hill area developed by Bukit Sembawang. And right behind us is probably going to be another new plot of land that is going to be released. What this means is that new homes are going to be built and in the future when buyers actually look into this area to purchase, the new plots of homes will be a new benchmark pricing, helping us push up the pricing of our home right here. Let's go check out more in the house. a bit more about the home facts. So Luxus Hill is situated in District 28 and the land we are sitting on is a triple nine year starting lease from 1879. Luxus Hills is also predominantly made up of inter-terraces. This house is actually launched under the Luxus Hills Contemporary Collection. There are only two semi-Ds launched in this collection which means that it is actually a very rarity to come by for sellers to be selling the homes. Today we are sitting on a plot of huge land, 2,988 square feet. The width stands at 9.8 meters, step of 25.4 meters. Since we are also in the three-story mixed standard zoning, the house has also been maximized to a 15.5 meters in height. So now let's talk a bit more about the floor plan before we move on to the house. For level 1, we have our car porch, we also have our swimming pool, and we also have our living area, dining area, as well as a dry kitchen. This home also comes with a hydraulic lift. We also have our guest room on level 1, as well as a guest bathroom and wet kitchen at the back, as well as our backyard. So for level 2, we also have our master bedroom with ensuite and a balcony, as well as a junior master bedroom with ensuite. And for level 3, we have two common bedroom ensuite as well. Of course, we also have our attic level with the open terrace space. Location wise, today we are located in District 28. So within 1km, we have Rosai Primary, Aukang Primary, as well as Fernville Primary. We are also surrounded by several amenities such as Greenwich V, Salita Mall, as well as Aukang One. We also have a 5 minutes drive to CTE and 9 minutes drive to TPE. We also have the upcoming Serangoon North, which will be ready by 2029. a bit more about the pricing. Just Lee, come, let's share with our viewers. <laughs> on the pricing? Yes. It's quite easy to justify on the pricing. The reason being, if you take a look at the older land that you can find right behind us, at the two-storey mixed lander nearer to the Salita area, at a similar size of 3,000 over square feet kind of land size, they are already asking about $5 million. And that translates to about 1,600 over odd. PSF. So taking this quantum of $5 million, then you input the total renovation cost of about $450 per square foot. With a similar size of what we can get here, $4,500, that will bring you to a total rebuilding cost of $2 million. And I haven't even added on the private lift plus the swimming pool and the whole renovation that you can get here. I think it's going to bring you to a total quantum of $2.5 million. So in totality, if you were to go and buy a old land and going to rebuild it to a brand new semi-detached of this facade and this kind of uh, features, 
that's gonna bring you to about 7.5 million dollars not forgetting all the time that you need to go and plan to talk to the builder to go and rent for the family in the meantime yeah I'm comparing it to this place uh, where you can move in right away mm. and then another interesting fact is that we have another new launch that we have been talking about which is Poland Collection those inter-terrors have already been sold for 3.6 and the semi-D are easily above like 4 odd million dollars yeah. and that's only the first phase of the launch. By the time you have many different launches, who can know what is going to be the future pricing for the lander in Singapore? Yeah, and also those land over there is 99 years leasehold, right? Mm. As compared to what we have here, here our land is triple, triple nine, years. nine years. So that's as good as freehold. If you are a frequent watcher of our PLB Landed Home series, you also know that we always talk about the four different categories of landed. Cat 1, we have homes that are suitable for rebuilding to tear down and fully rebuild. Those homes are usually around 30 years old or more. Cat 2, we have the homes that are around the 20 odd years old, suitable for either rebuilding or ANA works. Cat 3 homes are usually 15 years or younger homes that are suitable for renovations. And of course, Cat 4 homes are brand new homes from the developers. So over here today, we are kind of in the Cat 3.5. You can just move in this home without doing any form of renovations because I think our owners have really taken care of this home and the renovations are really very beautifully done up already. So now we are on the attic level and we have Jessly again. <laughs> So Jessie, maybe you can share the viewers what is happening right here behind us. Yes, yeah, so for all the potential buyers or agents when you're coming here for a viewing, you definitely will see this whole plot of land under construction. So yes, it may cause a little bit of inconvenience as of now, but what I see here is a whole land of opportunity and potential for our semi-detached to grow even further in terms of price point. As of now, we are still not really sure whether it's a 99 or is it a triple nine or is it a freehold because it hasn't been launched launched yet yeah but what we can tell you is that land in Singapore is really scarce so if you take a look at the whole barrier right over there that is the segregation between the two-story mixed landed and where we are standing is a three-story mixed landed so as we know there's only about 73,000 landed homes in Singapore so it's definitely a scarcity and rarity for us even though this plot of land will be released in the future I think the supply levels is probably gonna uh, you know yes. yeah stay around the same level of today's home tour. We hope that you have liked this home tour so far. Our asking price is at 6.99 million. So if you're looking for somewhere with exclusivity and privacy, do contact Jesse for a viewing to come check out this place. Do like and subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't done so. We're also on Facebook, Instagram and TikTok. Property Lim Brothers, always happy to show you the place. You say 70, I say 80, but you say 100. 100? <laughs> <laughs> Multiple choice question. What size is this TV? 70, 80 or 100 inch? <laughs> Mackie, you wanna join the home tour? Come here. Go! <laughs> For nine years? So that's as good as freehold. Mm. Freehold. Anything else? <laughs> A two-story mixed lander, and where we are at, a three-story mixed lander. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Standing is a three-story mixed lander. Mm. <laughs> okay. So, so 